must muddy the waters. You Sarah's big. We like you Sarah better than Maid Scribe. Yeah, we do. We do. You Sarah's big. We like you Sarah better than Drake. Yeah, we do. We do. <laughs> yeah, we do. I think we do. Hey, buddy, watch this. So let's play Reno. Let's make some stupid Reno deck. Spell damage plus two. We can do some crazy spell damage. What about Thief Reno? That actually sounds pretty fun. Let's do a Thief Reno. Arcane Crafting is probably the best bet. Just I think it's like a generically good hero power, right? So let's do a Thief Reno. Reno's Crafty Lasso. We're going to do a Burgle Thief Reno. So mostly going to be operating out of the rogue side of things, I think. Just going to kind of grab the things that look sensible here that are exciting to me okay not as much as i expected based on that wording i think of the right word to look for yeah class another class that's what we want that's what we're looking for could do seraphine i guess yeah whatever let's do it <laughs> i don't know i like it what passage we're we going for i don't know sticky fingers maybe i didn't really care i'm i i i, I actually I mean, there's obviously some inherent desire in duels to, to line up uh, passives, but I kind of wish there wasn't. I, I really do wish passives weren't as easily targeted and deterministic and that people were trying to, to play towards them. I think that makes the game mode less fun, perhaps more skill intensive, more rewarding for people who try, but maybe a little bit less fun or maybe a lot less fun, actually. I think it's way more fun to just... Uh, kind of just ride the waves. See where you land, you know? I mean, I just feel like Mage probably isn't going to have what we need, right? Mage just doesn't have a lot of Burgle support, right? Is there any just really good card we need to run in Mage? Like, maybe a maybe a Dawn Grasp? You know, theoretically, we, we could have a lot of um, random spell types that we've generated, right? So maybe Dawn Grasp to recast those. I could also perhaps add in one or two key ones just to make sure that we have something you know like a puzzle box rogue has some shadow spells i think shadow steps never too bad i suppose i need your guys help there's so many cards that could possibly fit that i'm having trouble thinking of what would actually be good i mean brand's kind of cool usually probably need some more early tempo-y stuff if i can that still fits the game plan that is currently could run a kazakis yeah, Zeph, I guess, is a pretty good idea because Zeph does also give you outside of your class card, so that could be nice. And just sometimes can be an early game card too, which is good. I feel like plagiarized solutionation, that sort of stuff's a little too slow. I want things that um same for same for clever disguise, those sorts of things. Yeah, no, I know what you mean with Dragon Sword. I, I think it's a good idea, but I don't I don't see it. I don't think it's in. There's always like Rune and, and Drake Fire. I could go Drake Fire and run the four drop Naga. I, I hate putting that in every deck because it's so unlikely to high roll into that. If we ran the four drop Naga, I would want one more big spell to increase that thing. Make sure it has a play. Sometimes it's not bad with like contraband stash, I guess. You know, maybe one more big spell. Drake Fire's fire, so like a big frost or shadow spell, fire spell. Yeah, mask is is definitely the front runner at the moment. Just don't think it fits my game plan super well. I'm kind of thinking about Shadow Step. I know it's not a big spell, and it could technically kind of backfire with Dawn Grasp, but it also could be kind of cool with Dawn Grasp too, right? Like Shadow Step with Tess, and I like Shadow Step anyway because of Tess and Wash Burglar and Zephyrus. Like Shadow Step's a really good play. All right, let's try it. Reno Burgle Rogue slash Mage. Reno the Thief steal some treasures. Parlay on one. I, this this first game or two might be pretty tough to win. I don't know. We're just kind of hoping to stumble our way into something good, which eh, it's a good game plan, actually. It's a good game plan. I just hope to find a magical victory. Like I said, I wanted this to be a pretty quick run. Uh, I want to focus on standard mostly today. So this looks like a mech pally. Okay. Reconnaissance might need to be pretty good. I actually need my four drop guy. This will be nuts. That's that's This is a way to steal the game, right? If I hit the four drop guy, we could just steal this game. Uh, Python's probably the most useful to me. Just a lot of stats, right? A pile of stuff to do, basically. That's fine. 
Hero power. It's okay. Ugh. Need Zephyrus. Is Zephyrus even good for that? Oh! Okay. We're in it, boys. Oh, nice. That's a good roll. That was unlikely. All right, we're in it. 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 This is also seven mana too, so we're in it. This is how we win the early games. We just steal them. <laughs> That's all you need. I mean, this is not necessarily even enough to keep up with this. This is what's scary because this mech warper could go absolutely insane here. Uh, Bjorn Winfeld, thanks to the 200 bits. Very cool. Alrighty, let's go. Let's muddy the waters. Onyxia's big and nice. Yeah, okay. I think we go for the taunt, right? Sleepy Dragon to support? Yeah, of course. It's not, nothing else is even remotely close there. And then let's uh, trade this off to protect there. Have I ever shadow set this guy? Contraband Stash is just a little dude right now. So you guys are telling me Mage doesn't count. So, no. Let's hold. Let's hold. Uh, yes, duels runs so can take a long time, but I'm hoping <laughs> this one goes quickly. We'll see. Sometimes things go differently than you hope or expect, but... Ooh! Cancel! Meccano is nuts! Thankfully the Wind Fury here doesn't really do much, so... They didn't really roll very well there. They needed Divine Shields. Okay, so yeah, we stole a game. Cool. That's going to really help us early, because I don't think this deck has win conditions early other than exactly that. Oh, boy. Uh, I mean, Rocket Backpacks is generically useful, right? Just has plays. We're going to be playing minions. Crystal Gem, I don't think there's anything specifically that I, you know, I can get a crafty lasso sooner, but who cares? Uh, robes, we're not usually drawing spells that much. I think it's probably Backpacks. Gem, I mean, can't help, right? But... Not reliably setting up anything busted as far as I can tell. What did we put that, that triggered a death rattle bucket? Anything? Just rec did reconnaissance give us a death rattle bucket? Strange. This is the best bucket. Uh, I've heard Secret Passage gives you SI7 cards, which I guess I don't love, but I mean, these are the best cards or whatever that's worth. I don't know. We're not going to have good buckets anyway. All right, some death rattly stuff. I think we keep the tempo here. We look for maybe like a double agent. We look for Zephyrus pretty good, I guess. Yeah, Zeph could give me some contraband stash activations. He has rush as well. This might help me keep up with some death rattles early, which is good. Haunter secret. Okay, cool. I wish this stole the cards from your opponent's hand. I think it does in the original thing, right? But that would just be so unfair and gross. <laughs> I understand why it doesn't. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. I get it. It's just, it would be so sick if it did. Hmm. Ooh, Trickster again, dude. Can we cheese another one? Explosive trap. Uh, okay, that's kind of a free, nice little explosive trap, isn't it? Mm, yeah, I think I gotta tidy up these death rattles, unfortunately. It doesn't feel very good. Oh, explosive trap, okay. So we think if they play another secret, it's probably this again. Good to know. Give me that Drake Fire Amulet off the top right now, baby. Come on. It's a 1 in 13, not even that unlikely. Come on. Come on. Oh, Dawn Grasp, okay. Similar, similar. This is a good fire spell for Dawn Grasp. Uh, Spirit Mount. I thought this was the other one for some reason, the one that discounted, but it's not. We can go backstab. Well, let's attack first. Proc that explosive trap. Probably just gonna go like Zeph backstab. Will it give me a backstab though if I'm at, uh, it may not give me the backstab, huh? Any better two mana option for Zeph? It's gonna give me a one mana play that will not kill a 2-2 usually. God, I can't remember the Zeph cards. I gotta relearn Zephyrus again. Yeah, it'd probably give me, well, it wouldn't ever give me Arcane Shot over Backstab, would it? Let's see. Why would it ever default to the one mana version if you have, yeah, see, it still gives you Backstab, okay. 
I'm glad Zeph's not crazy. Nice to know that Zeph's got something sensible happening here. Okay, so Trickster Sabotage could be a play, by the way. That's fine. Uh, Stash is actually not terrible if I have the only minion out, maybe. Yeah, we can just hit and then Trickster Sabotage. That's fine. I mean, I could get a weapon later, maybe, but... I think just killing a 5-5 is a pretty good result, really. Let's muddy the it's a deadly shot, essentially, with a 2-2 attached to it, right? It's okay. Uh, Spirit Raptor's not a spell-typed thing, right? I don't think so. Kind of forgot to look, I guess, but... I don't think so. Play my own Tarantula. I think hit hero power feels pretty good often as well. Not really itching to keep this Zeph alive, necessarily, am I? Uh, actually, how does that work? Do the 1-1s one summon mid-hero power? I don't think they do... If the hero power is cycle, do they? Uh, do you guys know? Do they kill the poisonous minions? Is the question I'm asking. Is the two two worth the trickster there? I don't know. I think I think it is, but it's a good question. Just play without combo. Yes, they kill the two twos. It's so crazy. Or the one ones. Okay, I'm trusting you guys. Okay, we just we just missed anyway. <laughs> oh crap. <laughs> was not the plan. <laughs> I just missed. I didn't hit it. Okay, well. Let's solve that problem, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. I probably still should have killed this, honestly. Just hoping the explosive trap kind of gets all of it, but maybe it's better to kill it just to be safe. Um... <laughs> you get no science for us. <laughs> No science for us to be had. Oh, okay. This is a good hero power. And good explosive trap. Thank you for that ordering. Yeah, nice. Okay, I guess they had to know that was an explosive trap, right? Oh, it wasn't worth it. It wasn't worth it, it turns out. The 2-2 two -two wasn't worth it. Come to find out. Not worth it. Okay. Alright, so Don Grasp has Explosive Trap, and I think that's it, maybe. <laughs> that, might, that might be all. Uh, is that another Explosive Trap? It can't be this time, can it? There's no way. Smell you. Seems impossible. I mean, dude, hero power is pretty insane here if this connects. Pretty... There's a chance it's a Freezing Trap, but I can still kind of replay this, right? Or just even play a, a, a Vanessa, too. If I play Vanessa, would I want to, like, prep first, maybe? Could prep Contraband Stash. Is there anything else I have? Backstab didn't count. Is it really just Explosive Trap? Hmm. Oh, true. It works with Wax Razor, so it would work with a thing. That's a good That's a good use case. Yeah, that, that makes sense. That's a good explanation, I guess. Contraband Stash sucks. Did I really miss? Are you joking? Oh, spirit. Oh, spirit mount. Oh, I forgot about spirit mount. God, missing there really sucked. I didn't want to freezing trap the one ones. Missing there really sucked. Not clearing that board, dude. Oh, that hurts. Actually gave them a death rattle, too. The demon seed grows in oh. Maybe it helped. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, they still hit it anyway. They don't care. They don't care. They're over it. Yeah, I regret that turn. Uh. Okay. I can trade this in to get a poisonous. And then hit again. And try to farm some hero powers here. If I miss again, dude, I'm gonna be tilted. Okay, please hit this. Oh my god, I keep missing! If I could, I would. Ugh, these hero powers, man! 
can get an explosive trap. He's pretty much getting close to death. So that's the next game plan. Yeah, he's on four to be fair. Yeah, like we're getting there, but. Wow, another five A. Uh, I think Dongrath's Pure Power just gives me the lethal, right? I've only played the one fire spell, right? Have I only played one fire spell? You wish to match wits with me. Close trap and ping. Okay. Oh, kind of a weird game. We, we did not get here. This. <laughs> I mean, he could have like a plated beetle and hero powered, I guess. That would be a one in three. A weird path to the victory, but we're winning games. That's what matters most. I'm, I'm a little salty about the lack of uh, good hero power rolls, but if it counts, it counts. <laughs> um, hmm. Okay. Frost spell, pretty good for Dongrasp, actually. This is a shadow spell for Dongrasp, but it, it can hit our own stuff. This is always universally good for Dongrasp. So maybe we take pure cold. All right, some burst damage. Plagiarize is on brand for us. Steward's okay. I think this is a little hard to work with, right? So probably we go plagiarize coerce here. Plagiarize fine. I don't know how the, <laughs> dude, I built like on meta decks that, you know, we like yesterday, we did we did win some games yesterday to be fair, but I, I build decks where I think they're gonna be good. And, you know, I'm like, oh yeah, this is gonna be great. We built this great thing. And I can't win a freaking game. And then I build some utter garbage expecting to lose. And it's it's 2-0. Oh. Uh, yeah. 2-0 oh is not remarkable. But usually we'd be 0-2 oh at this stage. <laughs> so somehow here we are. I wonder if I could force a good Zephyrus Contraband Stash this game. Prep Contraband Stash is kind of cool. Zephyrus problem is like, you know, you don't usually get a lot of good options. I don't think that's the move. I think we look for for more pop offs, more good burgle plays. Okay, I can't say that these are looking great. Actually, yeah, uh, that's not a great hand. Bombs are gonna just own me as well at some stage. Oh, that could be fun. All right, so that's kind of good. Six damage. Just get a couple things to do. Maybe some life gain. Get this discounted a little bit. That's nice. Thoughts on Beast Druid? Ah, uh, it's. It's a deck. It's an aggro deck. I don't. I need more direction in the question. Do I think it's good? Do I like it? Do I, you know, what's the uh, direction of your question? Sabotage. Shield blocks okay. Yeah. Scheme of things. I mean, that's a bomb gone and a co well, <laughs> it draws a bomb and then negates the bomb. So it's kind of like drawing a card, right? That's fine. Discounting here is good too. Even more bombs. What a delight. I don't know. Do I try to win this game like straight up? Do I try to get like full hand shenanigans? It almost never works, I feel like, in this matchup. Ranker. Okay. Remember, they have a ranker, by the way. And a shield block. We don't want to fuel the ranker if we don't have to. So, shield block is currently in my contraband stash and tests. Uh, Dawn Grasp is, I guess, still nothing. Optimal deck for Beast Druid? Oh, I don't have any idea, man. I would just go to HSV play and grab the one that looks best. That's, that's always my strategy. One that has the highest data. Data wins. I don't think I rank her yet, right? Huh. It's kind of a win condition. It's like an awkward one, but it's kind of a win condition, right? I mean, I don't know, actually. Let's just do this. This kills this, actually. I don't need the hero power, so. I don't hate it. I mean, I think I still lose to bombs in a lot of cases, but it's it's a, it's actually pretty cool, uh, like just insane endless value train too for like contraband stash and stuff. Which is fun. <laughs> Friend was too slow four years ago. You're right, but what else am I gonna do? I Remember, mean, it is four mana, so you know we'll see if it feels worth it to. Um, 
to spend the mana on the additional cards, right? We're going to have to kind of play that by ear. Because they are indeed very big. May not even die for a while, so it may seem like it takes 100 years to finish it. So yeah, we'll, we'll see. Can always play by ear. Because the first two or three of these feel really bad. They're five mana, right? I think. Yeah, true. I could use it to fill my hand. That's a good point with like contraband stash on these death on these spells that add another spell to your hand. Give me bomb immunity. That's a good idea. I like that. I like where your brain's at. Ugh, in a weird spot here. I don't want to go like too too wide because that plays into brawl. But I guess at the same time, like, what am I gonna do otherwise? Uh, this plays around Ranker at three. This dies to Ranker. So if I go here, I probably want to play something at three health. I don't really care about hurting my own mana here, do I? I don't think so. But I do want this to trade because it's better against Ranker. Guess I still could have given that rush for the record, but I don't think it matters. <laughs> at least not right now. <laughs> Kind of trying to keep them where they think, oh, this is not really the ranker turn. Is this the brawl turn? It's kind of small for brawl. You know, we're creating these sort of middle of the road awkward boards that make everything they want to do feel probably just a little bit bad. And then we hope, you know, that that nets us incremental advantages. Just iron hide necrotic poison, okay. Yeah, these are five freaking mana, dude. If I could, I would. Ooh. That's fun. Make it three mana. That feels a little better, doesn't it? <sighs> yeah, let's play another big guy here. Create one more kind of awkward-ish board. So, so I play the 2-2. Two -two. I don't work. think I play the 2-2, two -two, right? Let's hold. Again, trying to keep these kind of awkward boards. Yeah, seals are shadow spells. They also come back in contraband stash potentially. So gotta decide how quickly or if if I want to utilize these at all. Cause again, you know, it's just a big tempo sacrifice. Right now I'm saying a five six is much better, particularly when it discounts this, right? Uh so they gained quite a bit of life there, unfortunately. I drew a bomb. Serathine only transforms the minions, yeah. Sadly. Cause that would be kind of cool for uh for bomb transformations, right? I feel like I'm gonna end up giving them a really good ranker here, unfortunately. If I go this round, I give them a really good ranker because there's two small things. I'd honestly rather maybe just hero power this to play around ranker a little bit. I could go here and then play two of these right away, right? It's pretty cool, but just I really suck at ranker. You've been in tighter scrapes, Reno. You've been in tighter scrapes, Reno. Just, like, how am I going to fill the rest of this turn, right? Still a really miserable turn here. Okay, this puts me at bomb burn status. That's good. Next turn, I can probably play these together. Oh, that's a good ranker, I guess. <laughs> I mean, sure. Yeah, why not? Does it just have 10 damage showing? Is that ever something interesting? I don't think so. Guess I even hit Dr. Boom here and just fully rank her, right? Like, yeah, all those... All those bombs go off, but I'm negating them on average about... I lose a little health on average, I guess. It's also not a crazy hero power, but I think I just need to make sure I heal a lot here, right? Otherwise, we're going to get screwed. I'll take that. If I wanted to deal another five, I could go for like, you know, a sabotage. But I think I want to max heal. Four, 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 three, three. I lost one health. Yeah, OK. <laughs> About what we expected, really. Let's muddy the water. I don't want to play this guy because I think it, it, it feeds another ranker too much. Dropping frames. Yeah, I don't know why. Seems like yet another internet problem. I can't I can't wait to figure out how to not figure that out and solve that. <laughs> I can't wait. Uh-oh. Oh, oh this will just burn bombs. Yeah, nice. 
I mean, here's the thing, though, right? Like, these seals aren't doing anything. Oh, no, that didn't burn a bomb. Shoot. I took the damage. No! Oh, my God, dude. Going face. Absolutely zero chill. Zero chill. I mean, I think this is a test, right? I think this is a test. Just go big. It refills the hands. Um... Trade these to play around a little ranker action. Oh, Tess does replay ranker. You're right. Yeah, I don't need to trade. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Good point. Good point. Tess has a ranker for sure. Tess has a bunch of minion summons. It's going to put stuff in hand. Yeah, it's a good test. I sure hope Tess rankers first. Whoever replay this because it's going to get rankered anyway. I don't know if I leave one behind. I heal him quite a bit. Let's just let's just test. Let's not get fancy. You have no idea. Oh, shield blocks. Oh, crap. Of course. Needed that to be at the end. Anchor a little late. Do I ever shadow step test? I think so. Pretty good. Still a monster lethal threat board, right? I'm still at 10 for bombs. Yeah, this was good. Ranker heal. Oh, they have a great ranker here, though, because the test left four <laughs> minions out at one health. <laughs> Tess! You idiot! You needed a ranker first! <laughs> Why are you so bad, Tess? Gosh dang it, dude. This is just never going to show up in time, by the way, right? Like, it just doesn't matter. Okay, so here I guess we can sabotage. Tess adds enough of these to hand right that I can just replay Tess no problem, I think. What do I do with all these cards? So I can sabotage to remove this and still test. Do you ever do Rio? <laughs> no, I don't, but um but I will for you. I will for you. So crazy. Just this might work. Still worried they have a brawl. Oh man, this does this does actually expose me a little bit to the um, shield block drawing me a bomb, but I guess that's okay. I need these to go off before the shield block, basically. Did she play these in order? I got the shield block first both times. Are these always in order? No, because Ranker came in a different order this time. Just a coincidence, I guess. Okay. Back to 10. Lethal board set up. I'm worried about a brawl, though. We haven't seen a brawl still. So I don't know about after that. What do I do after the brawl? Maybe they just don't have anything left after the brawl. Maybe I can just chill. Just play these. Oh, my. Okay, that's not a brawl. There are 26? What do I have here? Not 26. <laughs> 12 and 5, 17. Okay. But I don't really have to do much. I can just, like... Trade and third seal, maybe? Oh, shield shatter, nice. All right. Armor, armor. Deal. Oh, hey, more life, yes. I will absolutely just... What do I do with all these cards? Trade this in and play seals, right? I can't, um... Doesn't really matter. Do I want another 2-2 two -two seal? I guess the hand's always full, I can't... I can play something else if I want. Because I get another, like I could play a double agent actually. Yeah, we should, we should. Then I get another one of these in hand. And I get to hero, oh, I should have maybe. No, no, I wanted it in hand, I wanted it in hand. No, that's right, that's right. This is perfect, yeah. I want more of these because I can make more stuff and still uh, fill up my hand, yeah. So they're down to literally four cards. I feel like they can't do it in four cards, right? Dude, this, dude, this Rin. Dude, this Rin absolutely saved the game. Because it's letting me play stuff while keeping my hand full. Usually, if you get into this scenario, usually you can keep your hand full, but it's hard to keep up on board because you can't play stuff. But in this case, I can play stuff and keep my hand full. Now that said here, I am actually a little bit in a pickle spot maybe. Well, this always refills my hand, right? But does it ever play a shield block that chains into a billion bombs, right? That's a little bit iffy, isn't it? Um, Double crust. I think I just leave up the 4-5 here. I don't really... 
doesn't really matter that much. Like, I'm going to try to hero power it, maybe. No, actually, let's just leave it and play two things, right? Like, we don't really care that much. Um, what does the final seal do? Is that... Is that... Uh, do you get Azari immediately, or do you... I don't remember what you get. Oh, yeah, okay. Let's just go bigger here. I could maybe play Azari on that last card. I don't think it matters much. But leaving four up should be totally fine. Just get the biggest boys possible here. Oh, wow. Okay. Jeez. Gross. I mean, it just doesn't matter unless their last card does... Well, actually, uh... This destroys that last card, but... It's kind of risky, isn't it? Because I can't refill. Yeah, there's no need to do that. I don't need to do that. Let's just play stuff. I actually think their last card is going to be a brawl. We never saw a brawl. So if they brawl here, I just make dudes and win. You know, I have 14 turns to beat fatigue here. <laughs> I think we'll be fine. Uh... Dude, this Rin absolutely stole the game. Oh, it's a bear odd, not a brawl. Okay, sure. That's fine, too. You just hit for a bunch here and reload. It's just was like the perfect counter, man. Just need to not mess anything up now. It'll be fine. Wow, literally played them to the bottom of their deck. Rin too slow, yeah. <laughs> Rin is too slow, Regis. Regis wanted a quick duels run, they said. Just a quick duels run, no big deal. Alrighty. GG, man. That was cool. That was a really cool Hearthstone game, actually. That was such a cool game. Rin might have been one of the only cards in existence that gets me out of this game, honestly. I can't imagine another card that would have been better. Wow. Cool. Good game. I don't know how this is 3-0, dude. This utter garbage deck. It's just three and zero. Uh, definitely not. Oops, all spells. Right, we have way too many good cards. Goggles is fine. Goggles is a good, good, uh, good general treasure. Right. Unlike these cards, which are not good general cards. I, I'm pointed here. Solarian's kind of cool. Fireball, deep breath is. It's okay. This is too low curve. This is not synergistic. So yeah, that's fine. I don't think the buckets have any idea what to give this deck, and neither do I. It's actually, actually insane. Rin MVP. Rin is still one of my favorite uh, Hearthstone cards. Not very good, super slow, but uh, I always liked the way Rin was this like really decisive win condition but it had this like clock and this timer and this suspense it's like oh god i've got to beat them before they finish the azari you know this like really cool big payoff kind of card i always thought that was so neat in in, in practice um i think our mulligans are so wacky in this deck anyway i'm just gonna push for the turn one drake fire <laughs> come on baby the problem, of course, is if I don't hit it, then this is probably something I'm going to have to just kind of throw away on a random spell. But that's OK, too, right? Like if I need to pure cold or coerce or whatever, it's fine. I'm just going to try for the turn one Drake Fire Amulet. You know, I want to high roll like a god. Come on, baby. <sighs> <laughs> The greed. Oh. <laughs> oh, the greed is good. Oh, don't be counterspell, bro. Don't be. Oh, I can't be. Ice trap. I can't be counterspell. It's on Um. Okay. 
Let's muddy the waters. Yeah. Not good. By Magni's diamond beer. Mm. <sighs> oh, I don't know, right? Hella has like more pop off potential, but Kazakistan's just an 8 8. I don't have any spells right now is the problem. These don't even make spells. This is stickier though. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's really close. I can obviously get spells. This is a, a more household to work with, so it's kind of stretches out longer, but and it, it kind of does eight damage, right? Or even more theoretically, like if this give me a cheap spell, of course, we'd be super happy. This can also give me spells like secrets and stuff. Uh, okay. Need to test explosive, freezing, all that stuff. Explosive, sure. Secret passage is not quite worth it just yet, I don't think, right? Snipe, okay. So we're gonna get a snipe here. It's pretty good. Hala should be alive, so. So we've kind of lost four damage so far, if you think about it, but I think soon we'll we'll gain that back. You know, Snipe will gain four of it back immediately. Just kind of thinking about whether this is going to end up being worth it or not, right? This can also kind of split damage, so it can both react to a board and go face, which is sometimes very useful, I suspect. Dude, he's only playing secrets right now. Serious, bro? Serious? Send my regards. Okay. This makes the snipe, what, zero mana? Yeah, that's fine. Could be an ice trap. So Hala's still only four behind Kazakasan, right? But now we're just kind of set up here. Not only a monster board, but Zephyrus lethal outs too. Any minion they play, of course, gets sniped out. Yeah, I don't know if Hala was right or not. I mean, I think it's gonna end up being the better choice. It's really close though, still. Looks to me like it doesn't matter, but. By Magni's, By Magni's beard! I don't even know what this was. Maybe a minion attack bait? Oh, I got the fireball, of course. Good God, dude. That is the grossest game, dude. That is so gross. It's not right. It's not right. Um, I feel like Army Knife presents the most shenanigans. I like that Blade is like pretty good to just keep pushing stuff. I feel like with like, I don't know, I feel like shenanigans with, with army knife are cool, but army knife can kind of get stuck in hand, you know, for goggles. Like this is not usually ever stuck. And this is pretty good with rush minions too, right? Like buffing the deck on everything has rush. That's kind of good too. I think it's actually this. Better fit for goggles, better fit for rocket backpacks. So yeah, I don't really totally love this, but it's probably slightly, slightly better. Um. Okay, a little, little cheap for goggles, but not terrible. This is not really very good. This is way too cheap for goggles, I think. So it's probably here. Generating stuff is nice. I don't know how this deck is 4-0, oh, dude. <laughs> I do not understand. <laughs> At all. I mean, we literally stole two games, right? Just straight up, just absolutely stole two games that we didn't deserve. Uh, we did kind of steal that warrior game too, I'd say. Maybe that's three games we kind of stole. Kind of risky here, but I don't really want to be playing this soon, so I have very, very few, like, dead draws. Drakefire Amulet I can trade off, so even that's not that bad, right? Parlay is totally fine, whatever. Seraphine's actually probably pretty good for three mana, right? I don't currently have a lot of minions that are going to be instantly useful, but... I don't like ruin my draws because I still have good spells. I lose like Tess, right? Tess is really good to lose. Zephyrus, but most of the minions in my deck, I don't really care that they're they're what they are. Cheaper minions might be fine. We'll see. Wow. Just going already, dude. Zero chill, huh? I can just play this for now. Mage spell is probably better. I don't think I want to rush here because I might just Vanessa rush. If they trade, I might just wash burglar hit too. We, we don't know. We got we got options here. Can actually play all three, I guess, with coin. 
Wrath, sure. Okay, so this feels like Vanessa. I'll take a Wrath, that's fine. We like Wrath. Oh, it's buff. Oh, God. Iron Roots. I can't Vanessa that. You fool. Whoa! Okay. No one crosses the uncrowned. I mean, how much bigger do we think this is going to get? He can heal it, too, is a problem if he has another nature spell. I don't know. I think I think Serathine will, will help keep up. <laughs> I don't know if I should say we'll keep up, but we'll help keep up. Um, let's not attack for him, though. Let's at least save five health, maybe, if he has to hit this. God, it's just all wraths. It's all they have. Need a way to do one damage. I'll have ping. Could just Reno's Wrath to clear this, but boy, does that feel bad. I don't think that's it. Just gonna wait one. Like, this doesn't die to a spell again, does it? It might die to hero powers, I guess. Ooh, fancy little stone mall. Do we take that to trade? I'm like kind of desperate, right? I think so. I think so. I think we do. Well, no, maybe we just play it, right? I got. Spellbender, Fireball next turn. That's three mana. Yeah, maybe we wait again. I don't. I don't. If this dies, I think it's just here. I think we can wait. Let's get greedy. It's so crazy. It just might work. Hero powers. That's it's. That's functionally fireballable next turn. Yeah, I like this. Let's wait. I'm, I'm thinking Druid doesn't usually have a ton of burst damage with this hero power, so I probably have a little bit of time, basically, is my thought. Oh, they're not even hero powering. Okay. That makes my life even easier, maybe. Although, not, not really, I guess. <laughs> In hindsight, maybe not. It's very, very large. Okay, Coerce is good. So can we swing this back now? I took basically infinite damage from a single 3-2. But now we're in a pretty good spot. Kind of two damage repeating here maybe is scary, but we're very far ahead on board. This can maybe show me what they're working with. Anything medium sized that comes down here can just be fireballed, no problem. Spellbender might save me some life here and there. Oh, dude, they are totally gonna... Go for a board buff, huh? Kind of scary, isn't it? I could try to snipe some hero powers here. Boy, is it risky, though. Let's see what we draw. <gasps> it's less risky! <laughs> You're kidding! It's way less risky! You're actually joking, dude. Hearthstone God! It's unbelievable! It's unbelievable how good I am at the game today. The game just loves me today. Unbelievable. Did I waste the coin? Did I play it without actually doing the thing? I thought I played it. Maybe not? Did I just coin and do nothing? I forgot. I changed my mind mid mid sequence. I don't even remember to be honest. Oh, this just made this just made Royal Gift better. Do I have lethal? Seven, four is eleven. 14 this adds 8 so 22 not quite now hmm. it seems to read like swipe right kind of weird isn't it i can play these together oh actually i have fireball too how much mana is that oh it's two so that's three and four not quite we do have so much damage though but there's something great inside. sort of reads swipe right yeah, I coined for some while I didn't play him. That's fine. I'm okay with that. As long as we... Oh, I should have done this too. Shoot. I forgot. Oh, God. Two of them. Even better. Of course. I mean, we see why he was going wide, by the way. So that Ravaging Duel absolutely saved me, by the way. Just completely insane. So now I'll get buffed if he goes for Royal Gift. And, uh, wait, did I play this first? I don't know. Oh, perfect. Counterspell. Get wrecked. Cool. Ravaging Ghoul absolutely stole this game. Oh my god, this poor guy. <laughs> oh 
no. Oh, dude, I feel so bad. We just absolutely just ruined everything. <laughs> we just absolutely. Oh, man. Plus two, plus two per win? Oh, that would be sick. Jeez, I wish. Hunter's Insight, we've actually had some pretty big hands. I think we could work well with that, yeah. It's like kind of redundant with goggles, maybe, but what on earth? Am I weird to sort of like this better? I mean, like backpacks is OK with that stuff. This is kind of a reasonable goggles mana cost lineup. I don't know. It's like, is, is spammy better than these board clears or just alternatively? Like, do I like these two minions better? I mean, I don't hate these cards by any means. The only thing is I like a little bit more proactive stuff for goggles, right? I don't want to have to like play a meteor on turn four if I don't need to. It's a little easier to play this stuff. Even a spammy like, yeah, it's a three mana three four on goggles. You know what I mean? It's OK. <sighs> All right, we got swift scale early again. I mean, are we feeling greedy? Are we feeling greedy? I, I mean, we might as well. I don't need this anyway. We can keep plagiarized. That's fine. Just move this over on turn two and I'll coin anyway, so it's kind of free. How greedy do we feel? That's not a big spell. That's a big hero card. This is pretty awkward, unfortunately. Oh, we're going to lose. That's they have zero mana, everything. Oh, my God. Dude, <laughs> dude. I mean, what honor? I still might lose is what's scary, because if they hit a good goggles opener, I still just get murdered, right? Basically, their stuff's just zero mana. This is a pretty good plagiarize for the record, but <laughs> I mean, this is a... if we're going to keep up, this was the hand, right? It's just so busted that these can. I, I don't know why Dragon Affinity is a tier one passive. It should not be. It's it's as good. I did get a lot of value for the record, man. I even got a coin. Let's muddy the water. You Sarah's big. We like you Sarah better than Mage Scribe. Yeah, we do. We do. You Sarah's big. We like you Sarah better than Drake. Yeah, we do. We do. <laughs> yeah, we do. I think we do. Now this actually replays the fire spells as long as I don't play any other fire spells. Like play that in two turns. Um, please Sarah gives me like a, an awakens to fill in here maybe. Pretty good with Rush. Okay, so I, I don't want to use coin because I want to replay the, the Drake fire on four. So I need to figure out what to do with my mana here. Maybe just like trade ping is fine. Oh, coerce is pretty good, but I, I'd have to nightmare if I coerce. Do I want a nightmare? Not really, right? This gets rush, which does help me a little. Maybe we'll just play this. That's fine. I would love actually like a one mana fill card here. I think would be perfect. Or just a big Alex Draza. I mean, Kazakistan's gonna be active, is that? That maybe just better for me? Just get some treasures? It's because I have one, two, three already. Well, actually, that's not enough yet. It's actually technically not enough yet. It might get stranded. No, let's go for the reactivity. I think I like this more. Kazakistan's a little greedy, I think. I'm gonna burn cards, but that's okay. I, I I think I just have to save this for more tempo, right? I want another big guy. You played a Malcolm? Yeah, I counted him. One, two, three. One, two, three. Because Akasan would only have had three, right? I mean, I might get more off you, Sarah, but we don't know. For now, we just chill. Dream's good. That's a good way to react to something. Yeah, we like that. <laughs> So just went Don Grasp here for another Drake Fire. We didn't mess that up, right? I could go pure cold and like really greed the Don Grasp, but I don't think that's right. That feels wrong. I just want the tempo here. Stack, I think, usually lacks reactivity because they've got like all minions. So if I can just cheese more big dragons, I think we'll be all right. Which is good. What do I do with all these cards? And I want to just get this for goggles too, I guess. It's another nice upside. Now, I don't get to pick these, right? They're just random. Oh, not bad, though. Man. Do I have a nightmare here just to clear that, maybe? I trade out a 3-4 that would be traded into anyway. 
I gain a card out of my deck and I gain four damage. I think it's worth it, actually. It's like I'm sacrificing four damage, but I might just gain it as well. I don't want to use it on Aesera because they're still really good. <sighs> um, Maybe I trade into this first and try to snipe it. It's only a 50-50, though. It hits this like three times I technically lose damage. I'm gonna wait. I think Nightmare is better than the average card in my deck. Only like Tess and maybe Zephyrus are better. I think we're okay. Dude, an army of 412s, by the way, is ridiculous. Oh, this is the AoE I was looking for earlier. So now we've got Bonkers Goggles, Full Hand, Coerce Clear, Dream Clear, Ysera Clears. Like, we've got a lot of stuff going on here. Probably just always open with Twilight Drakes. Um, I mean, I have so many spells, I might be able to set up some, like, pseudo-lethals if Hollow lives. I don't know, I gotta think about it, because... Three health on minions on board. Hmm, that's an interesting trade. I wonder what that's setting up. Hey, Vanquire, dude, thanks for the 12 months! One year's insane! Oh, a Nixie's naughty for four mana. Oh my god, okay. I see. I gotcha. How you got four mana on Nixie's in this deck as a regular thing? Like, are you joking? What, what, why, why is it actually so cheap? Draconic Studies twice, Goggles negative two, and Affinity negative two. Like, can you believe this? Can you actually legit believe that this is a real thing? So... I think we just hero power trade coerce, right? I don't think I get fancy here. Hero power is really good. I guess I actually even trade here, don't I? Yeah, 10's probably fine. Another Agnixia is not coming down just yet, right? Oh, I didn't combo it. Oh, God. I forgot to combo it. Okay. Well, this might really waste some damage then, though. Well, literally wasted, I guess, but... Oh my god, we're actually just gods. We're actual gods. I just went all the face. <laughs> it doesn't really waste it, to be fair. But I, you know, I didn't I didn't lose a single drop. I hit all face. <laughs> like, what an insane eye roll. Okay, so now pings and pure colds and alexstrazas are going to win us this game very soon. I mean, they do have hero power, to be fair. So they can heal a fair bit. Nightmare still got me four damage. I gave up a 3-2 for it. That's totally fine to make sure the Onyxia goes away, right? Playing off the right side of their hand is good. I wonder if this is another just big dragon they greeted, like a Kazakasan or something. They're just waiting to play. Kazakasan would be too slow. Alex would be pretty good, but a little slow. Oh, they're going to play it here, I bet. Let's see. Oh, no, they're playing the second one. What is this one, then? Oh, maybe it's another Onyxia? Alex? It's Onyxia again. Wow. Good god, dude. What an annoying dude, honestly. Never seen a more annoying dude in my life. <sighs> I mean, Awakens leaves up an 8 8. They're probably just like ping face, right? Maybe still just play the Twilight Trick. I want to create game ending scenarios soon, though, so I feel like pinging face makes more sense. Um. I don't know, though. I don't think it's time to totally give up on the board, right? Because they're running out of steam. I can still win on the board, probably. Definitely don't dream on Ixia. Blizzard seems better than Polymorph here because it's asymmetrical, right? So I can stall and just kind of go over the top, maybe. Okay. They're definitely still going to be focused on trading. Hopefully they don't have any more Welp Makers. This is 8 mana. Or no, it could be a... Uh, 10 mana card again, yeah. It's, it's discounted by 4, so we don't know. Could be anything. It's probably big, though. They've been holding onto it for a long time and not opening up their goggles, right? So it must be fairly large. And the cycle oh, okay. Of life. Sure. I think that's what we actually predicted last time, wasn't it? <sighs> so... What are, am I looking at for damage here? 12... 14? It's actually not quite lethal yet, huh? Sort of annoying. Hmm. I think I'm just setting up for next turn lethal, though. 
King face, third five. I have, oh no, I don't have enough mana for that. Oh, well, theoretically. Yeah, they go to eight. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. I was thinking I don't have enough mana for hero power and Alex, but I shouldn't actually maybe need enough for hero power and Alex. If they like heal a bunch and I need to pivot, I can always just blizzard and buy another turn or two, hopefully. Um, I think 27 should feel pretty safe. I guess something like Gnomish Army Knife would be pretty brutal here, but hard for me to play around. I bring life. Ah, okay. There's the pivot. Sure. Uh, alrighty. This is annoying. Next turn I can ping and Alex, but I actually don't think it's going to be enough, right? Because I'll have 12. I'm pushing them to... 11 here, but if they heal, they'll be at 14. So it won't technically be enough. <sighs> Is this actually just like a better stall right now? But I want to ping always. Hmm. So he's only going to have six mana left. That's really not that good. <sighs> this doesn't feel that great, does it? I'm running out of time here a little bit. Dream Onyx to buy more damage. I don't hate that because I don't really care if they replay it, right? That's sort of a good idea. Yeah, that's a good idea. So I don't really care if they replay it. I'm gonna just win, right? This makes sense, actually. Yeah, this is good. This creates the lethal breakpoints for me. Yeah, this is this is good. This is good. Because who can replay it? I don't care. Well, they can't even replay it right now. It's on the wrong side. Well, they can. Never mind. Dragon Affinity. But go ahead. I don't care. Heal 10. I mean, there's like a chance I'm dead, I guess, to something. But it seems unlikely in Priest. I'm at 19, so I'm ahead of like, you know... Pure cold or whatever, for instance. Yeah. So I have, theoretically, 16 damage next turn. Even if they had a taunt, Alex hero power would be enough over the top with a single hero power. Yeah, I like this turn. It's good. Battlemaster Book the Dead would do it. Yeah. I mean, it's... it's Listen, it's duels. There's always a way to kill people. You can die from 40 sometimes, unexpectedly. But, you know, we're, we're assuming, for most instances, we're pretty safe here. Be quick. Isn't it crazy how close this game was, even though I got the crazy Drake fire pop off early? Like, this was still a close game despite that. Because Affinity Goggles is just so absurd. Order doesn't matter. Blood Moon matters. Oh my god, are you joking? I have. 8 and 4 is 12, and 4 is 16. Is this real life, dude? <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> I am tilted. So this is fine. Huh. We go one more time. Problem is, though, I don't have enough mana again if they just hero power, do I? Shoot, I don't have enough mana. They go to 14. I only have, uh, I only have, tw well, if they play on Nixia, which is what they might want to do, I only have 12 or eight alternatively, but I don't know. We can always, we can always just figure it out. I don't know. We're not like dead or anything. So let's see. Oh God, dude, just play on Nixia, dude. Don't heal. Why do they have so much life gain? <laughs> Kazakistan doesn't matter inherently, but if they get it like vampiric fangs off hero power, it certainly could matter. Um, well, actually, it matters right now because I can't kill all this, can I? I guess Ivis maybe can. Awakens, ping it, Ivis or other ping here so they don't get life still, I guess. Scalebane doesn't really change anything. So I don't have enough mana for this is only 12, right? So that's never the play. Um, Awakens, ping plus any minion, I guess, on the Kazakusan is fine. Uh, you have lethal. Huh. Usera Awakens hasn't dealt face damage in like two years. It's only it's only minions now. How much mana is that? Six, eight. I can maybe check here for a lethal, I guess. <laughs> Awakens works on works on dragons, just not. Uh, is that enough enough? No, it's still not enough. It's only ten. A tango. So brutal, dude. Oh, 
All right, now I can be dead to treasures, right? Embers, um, lo well, not locusts, I guess. No, not locusts. I mean, this is not really bonus damage, but still cool to have, I guess. Life steal could be could be nice. Ah, oh, dude, th this is so crazy, dude. Oh, so insane. Like they 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 were so aware of the Alex Raza. I don't know how they knew I had the extra eight every turn. Uh, okay, Duff another Drake fire is intriguing for the sake of the uh, the four drop, but we're not going to be hitting that often. That's way too greedy. I think this is actually the pick. Double Zephyrus is fine because if you have one, that means the other one is not. You know, you don't have, ever have two in deck. So it doesn't create any problems on itself. And then this retains the Zephyr. So there we go. Yeah, guys, I'm not accusing them of stream sniping. What on earth? Everybody's like defending them as if I said, I didn't say they're stream sniping. I just said they kept, I was, wasn't saying like, oh, they were suspiciously healing. I, I'm saying like, oh, they just kept healing. Like I'm frustrated, not accusatory. There's multiple reasons why you might heal. I'm a mage for God's sake or a rogue. I have burst damage out the wazoo. The one turn where we left that Alex up and they healed nine. I still think we made the right call, but that's the one turn I'd go back and look at again. I think it was the right move because, you know, I would have used the blizzard otherwise. And I don't know, we wouldn't have the blizzard later. So there still would have been some fast pee break. I literally even went and talked to my wife afterwards. I don't see how that was fast, man. I think three mana is too much for Seraphine, right? Let's look for better play. I mean, I guess she's two mana by Hunter's Insight on one. That's kind of good. Yeah, actually. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. If I could, I would. Oh. Don't be oh my yog, please. Ooh, Zeph too. Oh, I'm transforming Zeph though. Do I play Zeph or transform Zeph? Well, let's just see. I don't know. Probably transform him still. He's unlikely to be good early, and I don't want to wait forever, right? These. <laughs> oh, I'm just them. oh, okay. Pretty cool. Big dude. That's a pretty good one mana 5-6 there. I, this is almost like I'm playing uh, Dragon Affinity Priest. I have stacking discounts, right? Sarathy made everything two less, and then Goggles makes it an additional two less, right? So... It's very much like I'm playing, uh... Looking for these. This never really matters on health total, right? Like, the attack obviously may not go through, but... This order... ...is fine, right? I think we just go wide here. Yes, I'm out of stuff, but... Or, I mean, I'm out of stuff, so ramp doesn't really help me any. Oh, crash is cool, yeah, okay. Big old board. Uh, okay, we, I don't know, we gotta win on this. <laughs> it's like, the, you know, this is what we got. So let's win the game. This is my hand, and that's it. Hero powers might go a long way here. I mean, they only have a few mana, right? So that's a really good, that's a really good play. Jeez. Eye for an eye, sure, that's fine. Oh, eye for an eye, Proctor Quest. Wow, what a good secret to get off of your thing. That's so sick. That's actually really cool. I'm a little annoyed, to be honest. Snipe's fine, sure. Crash would have been better, but I gotta roll the discounts, right? So, it's fine. Okay. Uh, does Dongrasp have anything? No, right? Not a single Hunter's Insight even, although that wouldn't do anything. It's not even... Oh, it is Arcane. Okay, so you get a Hunter's Insight. All right. I need a value generator off the top. I need like Reno's Crafty Lasso or something. Maybe a Tess. A Tess would be good, honestly. I'd play this just to get to Tess ASAP. Tess has a lot of plays. Is this guy a neutral card? Priest card, right? Well, that's pretty good. Secret Passage is very good. Do I use it now? Yeah. I need to keep reloading here. Do we think this could be a spell disruptor, like an ice trap? It could, yeah. In that case, I'll just play it next turn. That's fine. Drake fire is not good. Oh my god. 
this actually works, right? Like, this duplicates, and then I keep these for next turn, right? Need a hand, Explorer? I think. <laughs> um... Dude, dude, <laughs> dude, I don't, dude, I just don't know about this, uh, about this deck, dude, like, <laughs> I just don't know about this deck, dude. <laughs> I mean, I just don't know, dude. I don't know if it's right to keep the Drake Fire or not in this spot. I just, you know, we could, we could have traded it and then copied the hand, right? But, um... And I would have actually had a little more mana too, but I I didn't want to lose the Drake Fire. I thought like we're kind of running out of steam, and I have Dawn Grasp too, so keeping the Drake Fire seems valuable, even if it's a couple turns off, right? It might give me that nice reload. Um, okay. I could, I could play a Drake Fire. I don't think I need it. I think they're dead, but <laughs> but you know, theoretically, could have played the Drake Fire this turn. Dude, this deck is so obscene. I just, I, the only game I've lost, we almost won. Um, I mean, like this, I, I sort of want to embrace this to be honest. Exerciser is probably the most like reliably good card here, but I think I'm going to embrace the chaos. Let's go. Puzzle box is like a little bad off goggles because if I'm behind on board, I can't really utilize it. I'll just buff my opponent's board, but it's okay. I just got a nice business email. It's from LH1936767 at gmail.com. Hello, blank. I hope you are doing well. We space space have been following your blog for quite a while. My blog. Your content is great and we like your videos. We want to promote our website on your platform. As by this website, people can watch a short video and earn, as well as by inviting friends using invitation code can get rewards. We will share further details after we get in touch. Hope to get a positive response from your side. Thanks. I think we're going to delete those. What do you guys think? Uh... Okay, prep's kind of fun, but let's 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 go here. I like this. We don't need secret passage yet. <laughs> Respawn, yeah. Oh no, Tess! No, Tess! You're gonna kill this run. I mean, Zephyrus can give me Tess stuff. I can trade out a Drake Fire, I suppose. You want to cast a spell? I want to cast a spell. Okay, Shatter's pretty bad too. Uh oh, <laughs> I think our time is done, guys. We yeah, we've scammed enough. I think I think it's over. I think our scamming dreams are done. This gives me like an animal companion, right? That's pretty good off task. Honestly, I'll play it. I think just the tempo here and the animal companion's good. Is wild growth better to get to test sooner? No, because I don't really have anything for test if I don't take the animal companion, right? So I don't think so. Uh Lestatus six the hundred bits, dude. Good memes, good memes. Hmm, that's a good clear. It's fun. I like Razor Petal Rogue. That's a fun deck. I've never seen this before. It's really cool. Just no one. Not even Caffeine and bullets with the five months, thank you. Yes, a Nigerian prince indeed. I've got millions coming my way. Oh my god, they even sent me a Twitter DM as well. With the exact same message. Oh my god, dude. Well, here's the story, guys. If you can't... It's just, you know, sometimes it comes in the opposite order, you know? Maligos? It's just the biggest, right? I don't have the payoff now, but it's just the biggest. Uh, you say our same story, right? Just the biggest. They're not they're not great, honestly, but just the biggest. Okay. This is the scammiest. Like, am I actually gonna scam this game back again, dude? I need a damage spell. Oh, Parlay could get me one. They um potentially have a lot. Oh, never mind. Scratch that. I mean, it still could, but. Oh! Shame that's, uh, again, not my 
actual class. Uh, actually, do we want to play Tess next turn? She's currently just an animal companion, right? Not very good. No, I don't think so. We're kind of we're kind of doing okay even without the goggles right now. So let's just stick to the game plan for now. Companion hero power, maybe. Like we've got a really good board. A uh, boner, dude. Thanks for the four months. B Bo Nair. Excuse me. I didn't. I don't think I said that right. Bo Nair. Make sure I really emphasize those. Bo Nair. This is not a great turn again. Kind of the worst minion, wasn't it? Please hit, please hit. Nice, thank you. So yeah, Contraband Stash is still just... It's nothing, it's just... Oh my. How is Wild Paw Knoll so bad right now? Jeez Louise, dude. I need Burgle plays. Okay. Did these not? Oh, there we go. I was gonna say, why isn't this getting updated? Potion's like the most value generation, I guess, right? So, I think I Hunter's Insight the next hand, actually. Right? Oh, wait, wait, no, I won't have it. I won't have it. So I can discount the potion here and take this out of my draw, which is pretty good. And then of course we Solarian. Hopefully kill this, or maybe just lethal, you know? That'd be nice. Okay. Spring water's amazing. Cram session's amazing. Deep breath's pretty dang amazing. Oh my god. Um, I think I still kill this, right? Like, yeah, I take some damage, but it's not the end of the world. It was going to do it anyway, so. I mean, dude. <laughs> dude. That looked cool, by the way. That animation was actually sick. I never really noticed that before. That was cool. Dude. <laughs> that was an insane. Like, I, I, I thought for sure this game was screwed, and we just got another Malagos. That, that freaking dude cast another Drake Fire Amulet. Like, this is so gross. I don't deserve a single win in this game, honestly. This run, I mean, this run. Okay, it died, so shenaniganery here is a little reduced, but I'll probably still want a potion. I mean, actually, I just have probably lethal with Zeph always, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like it to me. Oh, maybe not, actually. Uh, does Zeph ever give me, like, silence on this? Is there a way to concoct a lethal for Zeph here? I'm trying to think if there's a way to manipulate this so that Zeph helps me out here. Like he might give me a silence, but it's still not lethal or anything, right? Wind speaker, but I don't have doesn't help. I don't have I don't have silence. Hmm. Yeah, I kind of like it anyway. It just might work. Uh, coin potion. I don't get the Zeph back, right? I'm out of space. Yeah, unfortunately. I don't I don't get the Zeph if I potion here right now anyway. Dude, everything's just giving me more stuff I don't need. I get a Kazakas on, but I don't I don't think that's actually worth it. We can get like a test back or something too. Hand is just too full. Hand is too full. Let's see if Kazakas on can stick. Shatter the 4 1 to get the Zephyrus back. I don't think it's worth it, guys. That's so I don't know. I mean, that's a lot. It's not crazy, I guess, to be fair, but it doesn't seem worth it to me. What do I know, though? Feel the power. It's amazing just always drawing exactly the card you need. It's really quite interesting. <laughs> I mean, it's a good. It's really good to just always have the exact... I cannot draw wrong today, honestly. I am just picking my top decks, I think, dude. Crazy. Man, easy games, dude. With the worst deck I've made in months, honestly. The worst deck I've 
made in ages. <laughs> and we're seven and, seven and one so far. It's so crazy. We mana too much, right? We need better. We need better. We can keep a Vanessa. That's cool. Good burger action. Um, yeah, this is what I was talking about the puzzle box, right? We might be able to do something cool with Ram Commander, though. Wonder if I ever actually coin a Ram Commander here. Then I have Rune Door. No, we probably wait a turn or two. I don't think it's time just yet. Oh my god, there's a million things going off. Stop it! Uh, I don't know, Shiv. I think reload's important. So next turn I could Ram Commander. Kill that. Play some one ones. Oh god. Dude, really? Oh my god, dude. I had a fan of knives and I threw it away, dude. I threw it away. I had a fan of knives actually legitimately in my freaking hand. And I got rid of it like an idiot, huh? It'll come back, that's fine. We'll top deck it. It's all good. <laughs> the way this has been going. We'll just top deck it, man. Oh, I guess I have hero power too, don't I? Oh my god, I forgot about my hero power. We're just gonna farm hero powers. Never mind, I don't even need it, dude. Maybe this was wrong. Why did I even not just hero power? This is amazing. It took seven, well, five. Yeah, it's actually fine. I actually kind of like it. Just got better hero power action, basically, by waiting a turn, you know? Dude. Dude! Dude! <laughs> Dude! I am denying them damage and better minions right now, potentially, right? Like, this again might actually work out pretty well. Dude! Okay. This is actually gonna be the most insane turn. If these both go face, dude. If these both go face, I retire from our stone, okay? All right, come on, just kill most of these, please. I don't need everything really, but there we go. That's fine too. That's fine too. Does this actually give me anything? Did they actually play a card last turn? I don't know, I just want the body on board so I don't actually care. No one crosses the oh, I did, yeah, nice, okay. Oh, galloping idiot. Oh, shoot, I don't like that. I think this is still correct for the record, but... What? This is the word. These aren't four drops, these are three drops. Ugh. Jandis, dude, they got a 5-8, a galloping idiot, bro. Oh lord, Feoris is played. Oh god, I'm just dying. Oh god. Why even bother hitting minions, man? Why bother? These. <laughs> oh, I'm just bothering them. Oh, teacher's pet's really good. Wow. Looking okay. for these. I think we're kind of expecting a bear trap, maybe. Misdirection instead. Oh god. Okay, that's fine. I mean, you know, theoretically they take eight here. I got another seven. Like that's that's fifteen damage. Like, kind of getting there on like just killing them soon, maybe. If they attack, especially. This is weirdly good right now. Just shiv face. Oh, I mean, shift face. I take a risk though, right? Nah, better be careful. Oh, that's a good hit. Let's them hit this. Well, let's see if we draw a spell, I guess, or not. That, that may change things. <laughs> Silverback putting in work, dude. <laughs> Saving me some life. Thanks, Silverback buddy. Oh yeah, we drew a spell. Okay, that's better. So I can shiv face first. This is still good enough to clear the board. Um. Roll these discounts, basically, right? I don't know, I think I play a minion here, right? I do really want to eviscerate too, though. Hmm. This just isn't that good to me. Getting 
I don't know. I'm pretty far off. They killed me in like kind of two turns almost. Fast here. Uh, I don't know. This is really tough. Just trade, you think? Maybe, yeah. Okay. Oh my god, please attack, please attack, thank you. I don't even know what Dawn Grasp has. It's just pretty clearly the best card, I think. Puzzle box. Oh, I'm dead, okay. That solves the problem. <laughs> dude, that, that hero power hit the one, two, two. Come on, dude, like that is so crazy. Uh, all right, that was actually pretty close. I made the genius play of baiting the hero power. Didn't help though. Worshipper's kind of good and flexible, right? Good, good goggles card. Yeah, beauty a little, little pricey maybe. Hey, Thunderstone, dude! Thanks for the uh, 12 months. Actually, insane, man. Huh? I've never in my life seen this bucket. I don't think. I mean, they're kind of the right costs. These are that's a pretty good rush minion to be fair. That's a pretty good rush minion too to be fair. Uh, these are rush minions, but not great. Hmm. I think I sort of like this better. We already have weapon. This this kind of doesn't help us tutor the uh, blade all that reliably because we add another weapon in. Haunter seems pretty bad. So I think I actually take this. Loot order draw. Divine Rager's good with rush. Good mana costs for goggles. I dig it. Dude, seven wins. I'm like I said, it's four wins. This deck's done enough to be a, a, a cool deck at four wins. Seven wins is like, forget about it. I predict the opponent high rolls you now. Well, we would deserve it if they do. Can't be mad about that. It's probably pretty silly. You're probably right. I'm going to need some craziness here. Going to need some insanity. This doesn't feel like the hand, does it? Doesn't feel like... Like, last time, the only reason we could ever beat the, the Dragon Emerald Goggles Priest is because of the early Drake Fire. Like, we can't beat that deck normally. Yeah, it's like, yeah. I didn't be the same person. I don't, I don't remember what that person's name was. Oh, yeah. GG. I don't think it's the same name. Uh, ben Jim Jam, thanks for the 14 months you jinxed us, so you are officially banned forever. I hope you enjoyed your time here. Blade's big, but I don't know what on earth to ever... I don't think that's it, unfortunately. <laughs> it's just, you know, here comes a, a six drop dragon. Here comes a seven drop dragon. I think this is just too easy to get. Like, but this this pair in particular, it's just everybody always has this this exact pair. What a terrible hand, by the way. Very clunky. I'm literally just hero powering. You know we ain't gonna win this game. I think this should be a tier two. It's it's as good or better than goggles, really. I mean, it gets kind of worse as the run goes on because you don't always get dragon buckets, I guess. But they they always seem to have enough. I don't. It doesn't seem to stop them. I need magic, man. I don't know what I I don't know what I get here, but I need some magic, dude. I, I don't know. Mass poly or something. Volcano Mancy, Ice Blood Tower. Oh god, I don't know. We're dead. We are dead. There's 14 damage on board. <laughs> I mean, we're just dead. I don't I don't see it, dude. There's maybe some kind of crazy spammy arcanist play, but I need them to play a three, four, six, seven, and eight health minion. <laughs> okay, there's the six. Now I need the three and the four. We, are we already have a two, that doesn't help us. Well, I can trade in my two now though. So I need a seven and a four. Go ahead and play a seven and a four health minion, please. Okay, they're not playing a seven and a four. I need a spell off the top. Yeah, nice, okay. Is this only five though, really? Try to coin a hero power. Kind of my only shot, right? Uh, oh, I could go Volcano Mancy. Oh, what if I hit this one and then, oh, that'll work. You can kill this one. Oh God, I'm an idiot, I forgot to trade! Yeah! I forgot my minion died first. God! Just setting up for spammy, that's all. We were screwed anyway. 
We aren't beating that. I don't feel bad at all. Ugh. Forgot my dude died. Sad. 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 Two hour duels run. Quick one like I wanted, you know? Nice, nice quick one. Nice quick one. I wanted a 30 minute duels run. And it turned into two hours. Uh, hey, you just had a pretty fun casual Drekthar Shaman TKO duels run. That's too many words. Uh, maybe you're going to explain it. Draw spell power. That's the longest message I've ever read in my life. Uh, sounds awesome, dude. I can't read all that. It's too long. My brain is going to melt. 